probably in junior high, you know, everyone, you have a little bit of baby fat, you know, whatever. But um, I started working out every day, actually. I worked out on one of those ski simulator machines. And, um, but it worked. I mean, it got me into shape and I, I felt really good. I, I actually liked the way that I looked in, in high school. Then I entered into college and it wasn't the freshman 15. It was like... <laughs> doubling my body weight very quickly and so um, I was having uh, I had some medical issues and hormonal issues and um, that's what caused it and it was very traumatizing <laughs> to me especially being in college you know meeting just new people every semester and trying to um, you know trying to learn but at the same time being so upset with the way that I looked and and embarrassed kind of and you know not really wanting to open myself up to meeting new people because I was afraid oh they're not gonna want to talk to me because of the way that I look um, in the end it actually ended up causing me to develop my personality more actually <laughs> so I always try to put a positive spin on everything so if I look back it, it was you know, I wasn't able to just kind of sit back and be quiet and just kind of smile and whatever. I mean, I, I had to really like show people, hey, I'm a person worth meeting and worth talking to and and that. So, um, but that was the only positive <laughs> aspect about it. Um, otherwise, it was just, yeah, it was not a good thing. And I, but I was, you know, like, then I started working and I just became comfortable and settled in, in a rut and, you know, didn't really try to do anything to to change that about myself. And then, um, then I moved to Los Angeles and that's when I started, like, you know, it's a new me. I want to be, you know, I was turning 30 and I was like, you know, I want to just change this all, you know. And that's when I began the process of trying to get back into shape. Well, the initial um, thoughts were, um, I was, I'm, I'm getting married in March, so it was, um, you know, I have to be able to fit into my dress because I did order it a little smaller than I should have. <laughs> um, so basically it was fear was my motivator, <laughs> and I could just imagine trying to zip that dress up and it not going quite all the way up, so um, that's why I uh, called Sean to find out um, what what he, his program was and what he was offering and um, find out more about it. Well, I definitely felt my mood um, improve. Uh, I, was def I was in a very high stress position. I never really had bad skin, but I did seem to feel that my skin looked better. Like I stopped having to wear a foundation when I would go places. Like yeah. I wouldn't have to do that. I felt more than comfortable just going out without it. I definitely looked forward to the workout sessions so that I could go and I knew that I was going to be in a good mood when I left, no matter how negative I was feeling when I got there. My energy level um, went up quite a bit also. Um, I really, there had been in the past some weekends when I would wake up and I would just be so exhausted. I didn't, couldn't really do anything all day. I would just kind of like lay around, be a couch potato and blame it on the stress from work. And then once I started working out, I, you know, was back to the way that I used to be where I would, you know, get up at 7.30 in the morning on the weekends even and, you know, take care of my errands and then, you know, do fun, fun things and go out with friends and things like that. I did lose um, four inches in my waist. I, it was about three pant sizes, I'd say, which was good, very good. <laughs> and um, I don't know, it just gave me more of a positive outlook on working out as a whole. Um, before it had been more of, well, I have to go work out today. But then it became, oh, I really want to go work out. Uh, the hardest part was actually going the first time. It was a little intimidating the first time, I have to say, because I hadn't ever done strength training my whole life. I had just, you know, done some walking cardio, but that was about it. So it was um, intimidating to go to this gym and, you know, meet with you and because I had, didn't know you. And, you know, it was very, like, frightening, you know. <laughs> my, my concern was, where am I going to park? Oh, my gosh, you know. And, 
And then I got there and I felt immediately comfortable with you. And so I was, I was fine afterwards. I'm glad that I did it. I'm glad I didn't let that trepidation mm -hmm. <laughs> stop me. Mm -hmm. So, um, I think it was a combination of seeing results. A lot of it did come from, from inspiration that I got from you, like just the talks that we would have, you know, we always <laughs> talk quite a bit when we meet and it always, it's very uplifting to me, you know, and it makes me feel like, wow, you know, I can really do this. And, and it was just, I don't know, it was just a whole positive outlook. I started getting compliments like, wow, you look really good or, oh my gosh, you know, what are you doing differently? And, and, uh, one of my friends, I motivated her to start working out because, you know, she saw results in me. So yeah. it was just, you know, things like that, just positive, an overall increase in positivity in my life. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I work in advertising and I was working like a lot of hours actually when we first started that was in the middle of our um, high season. So I was actually working sometimes till 11 or 12 at night and started work at 9 a.m. every day so it helped alleviate stress so it made me um, I think able to think you know more clearly even at, during those late hours <laughs> there um, I kind of I had I had the energy there I wasn't getting tired like I had before I was you know fine to work that late the major thing that I learned was that you know you can only reduce your calories so much and that if you find yourself at a plateau then you need to increase your cardio um, and that that has helped like I did you know start jogging not just walking um, during my cardio training and I, I did really feel a difference there um, and then also in terms of strength training just always pushing myself you know to increase the weight and to you know, not have to take rest pauses in between, but keep going. So I've been moderately successful. You know, I feel that I've, I've got, um, you know, I mean, I'm engaged now and all that. So I feel that it worked. <laughs> <laughs>